Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back, and thanks for joining me in the Babe Cave today. My name is Andrea, and we are doing a Switch Out Sunday, because I haven't done one in a long time, and I wanted to show you what I switched into, and this is my LASNV leather black handbag that I've decided to carry, so if you're interested in knowing what fits in this gorgeous bag with this awesome strap, then stay tuned. Well, first off, let's cover the outside and then we'll go inside. Um, this strap, you know, some people don't like these straps you know because they're not leather but i really like the design of this black and white it goes really cool with this crossbody bag and i also like that it has this gunmetal hardware and you can also change the strap because it's detachable so yeah this can be taken off and you can add another strap if you'd like I don't typically mix gold with gunmetal, but look at this strap on here. This is the Coach Rainbow strap, and it looks so cute with this. So if I did want to do it as a shoulder bag, and I didn't care if this was mixed metal color, um, I could do that as well. But for now, we're just going to leave all the straps off, but this strap that it came with adjusts really nicely and it's really easy to make larger smaller very comfortable that's the thing about these straps you know some people don't like them but they are very comfortable straps so I'm probably going to leave this strap with it because I think it looks cute on it so again um, I wanted to use my coach flower charm because it has the almost the same hardware um i don't know if it's black or if it's gunmetal but it's very similar to this bag so i thought that was perfect what do you guys think i thought that was cute so this bag holds more than you would think it would hold here's the the side again the back has a a zipper pocket here no feet on the bottom. The leather is made really nice. It smells really good still. <laughs> so I needed to carry it. And I've been neglecting black bags. So I want to carry this black bag. And it's smaller size. So let me show you what I've got inside of it. The zippers. Very smooth. And I will, I will link this bag down below in case you missed it and I'll also link the video of the unboxing of this so you can see that as well. So in this front pocket we have my Amazon business card holder. Love this thing. It goes in every purse. <laughs> and this is a small little change purse. I think I got it Dollar Tree. So yeah I just put some change in there and it's very thin so that worked out good and then my phone fits in this front pocket because I learned that the back pocket does not fit um I tried it it doesn't work so so the phone has to go in this front part so, and I have an iPhone 12 Pro Max, and as you can see, it fits just fine in that front pocket. Oh, and a uh, butter rum in the front pocket. So, there's that, and that's what the inside of the bag looks like. I like the stitching. Everything is really made well um, on this bag, so no complaints. Um, like I said, I'm finally carrying it. Uh, let's go to the back of the bag where I was talking about. Again, these zippers are really actually pretty good quality. Not too light, not too heavy. And in here I've got Juicy Fruit Gum, hand sanitizer, and I think that's it. Yeah, 
and I'll show you how it, this just does not, if you had the smaller phones, this would probably fit, but I have the big giant ones, so that's not going to fit. So back around, let's go in, we've already went in the two pockets, and now we're in the main compartment. Again, the zipper's very smooth, and here's a look inside. And <clears throat> these are what, you know, I haven't changed out of my Louis Vuitton key pouch here. Same old thing, has the pink interior. Love this. I'm going to have to get this print one day <laughs> in a bag, but not yet. <laughs> And next, I'll pull out, you know, I always have wet ones. And my little to-go deodorant, because it's hot here. I've got some keys. I've got my pen. Another, my parents' set of keys, live in the dream. A mirror. Whoop. That's the back side. It's got this cool beading on it. I really like that. Like someone made that and I, I think my mom gave it to me. And I just have a lipstick, LA Colors, and it is in the color Perfectionist. Haven't used it much. It's like a, it almost matches my skin tone right now. <laughs> so there's the LA Colors lipstick. Okay, on to this this i haven't used that much and i have a code down below it's from dress up your purse and it's in this cool purple to black changing you know i believe this is lambskin if i'm wrong i'll put it up here but it just has the snap closure and inside i have my debit and uh some rewards cards and then my Apple AirTag, and I, this also has a key ring, but I'm using it for my debit card. So this is a cute little pouch. It's, I'm sure it's a similar size as the Louis Vuitton small Kirigami set that they make, and it's, and they, it, they fold just like this, and I'll pop up a picture of what it looks like. But this was very affordable, um, probably around $40, I want to say. Real leather, such a cool how it changes colors like that. The black into the pink and into the purple, super cool. I think it's called the Dream Collection. Um, I'll try to, you know, link that down below for you. So there's my cards. And next is what I... <laughs> what I got with this company, the LS L A S N V, and I'll link this down below as well. And it's also uh, a leather piece, and unfortunately, it's gold. But I like the gold hardware as well on this product. So has a nice zipper pull, has that little key ring if you wanted to attach your keys. Inside has my Vix. Vapor inhaler, Fanta, grape, chapstick, uh, <laughs> some ibuprofen, my perfume container that I got from Timu, and contact solution, band-aid, my, my usual just-in-case little pouch. It fits all of that. I love this little, I got the brown one and I got the black one. So, yeah, their, lo their leather is really soft. Um, you know, I don't know... What kind of leather it is, but it's it is soft. It is very soft. This purse seems a little bit shinier than this um, leather, but super cute. Love it. Went perfect in there. And then on the inside, I didn't use the slip pocket. It has that slip pocket on one side, and then on the other side, it has. There's no name here on the leather tab. And it has a zipper pocket. And I don't typically put anything but tags in the zipper pocket. So, yeah. There's the inside. It's like a, a shiny fabric. 
nice stitching. This bag's really made well for how affordable it was. Of course, I was gifted this to review, but these are, I think, one of, I want to say $24, or the link will be down below, but very affordable and real leather. You can't beat that. So, this is what I'm going to be carrying along with this awesome, you know, fabric strap. Which I love the design. That is my switch in. I'm switching into this, but I just wanted to pull it all out so you could see how much it held. Because it holds a lot for a little crossbody bag. Let me pan down here. See? So if you have any questions or, you know, anything about any of my stuff up here, let me know. And uh, like I said, I'll link everything below. And I'm going to enjoy carrying this little black leather bag. So until next time, I appreciate you all watching. Don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and comment down below. I'd love to chat with you. And um, also hit the bell so you won't miss my videos. The bell is important, so hit that bell for me if you don't mind. Because I don't want you to miss the videos. <laughs> so thank you again for watching. And I will talk to you all soon. Bye.